Hello Avisha fans and Handloom Sari lovers. Today in our Handloom Sari story series, we are going to be looking at Kosa Tassa Silk Saris. Kosa Silks are really a subcategory of Tassa Silks. It is a variety of Tassa and the speciality of Kosa Tassa is that it's very very soft. It's made from a type of silkworm that the silk is coming coming on very very soft. So within the Tassa grouping, Kosa has always has a special place because of the softness of the texture. Mostly Kosa Silk Saris are dyed in vegetable dyes or flower pigments. In fact, Kosa silk is very very famous from the state of Chhattisgarh. From the palash flower, the pigments of the palash flower are what goes into dyeing most of the Kosa silk sarees. This is the speciality of Kosa silk tassas and that is what we are going to see today. Now let's take a look at this beautiful reddish pink or magenta. Kosa Tassa Silk Sari. Wow, the silk is so soft to the touch. You have to really touch it to believe it. It's so soft. It's so nice. And the sari is so light. I'll just open it out for you. Yeah, this is how the body will look. As you can see, it's a beautiful color. I don't know. It's, it's a tone which is between dark pink, magenta and tones of red as well. It looks very nice. Very striking and stunning. You can see the beautiful tribal motifs. Some of them are in black thread work. Some of them are in white or a beige color I would say and the motifs have been woven so intricately and so nicely. This is a black one. I'll show you the white, the beige one. This is how the motif is uh, woven. It looks very pretty. Weaving is very nice, finished very well. So this is the body. Both the borders have got beautiful, lovely tissue zari, golden tissue zari. Both the top and the bottom border. Now we'll have a look at the pallu. Yes, this is the pallu. This looks like a piece of art. You can literally frame this and hang it in your living room. It looks so pretty. It's a fantastic. It's a tribal celebration. It's a kind of a festival. You can see somebody playing the drums. There's a woman who's dancing. And uh, generally the pe people are wearing very festive wear. It seems almost like a festival or a wedding. Lovely tribal motifs and tribal art and it's punctuated the whole pallu from top to bottom and around lovely heart motifs in white and black and with uh, tinges of pink. So it, it's a really really artistic pallu. Let's take a look at the blouse. The blouse is yeah it's a plain blouse which goes along with the uh, matching with the body. Yeah so if you look at the whole thing together this is how it look. Now let's take a look at this beautiful aqua blue Kosa Tassa silk sari. I'll just open out the sari. Nice, beautiful. It's the fabric feels so nice. It's so soft. Lovely booties, floral booties all over the body. Red, orange interspersed throughout the body. Really sets off beautifully against the aqua blue background. There's a red and aqua blue mixed short color border both on top and the bottom and very very nice very stylish and very pretty i'll just uh, show you the pallu now beautiful stunning pallu lovely beautifully woven motifs on the pallu as you can see in the center section you have lovely little tribal hut motifs itself has got beautiful floral decorations in the entrance and the roof there's a leaf and there's floral elements again on the on the top, the tiles of the roof. So, so intricately woven. Each house is almost different. There's a central house in with a green uh, tinge on the top, the roof. On both sides is a black roof. The color of the uh, floral motifs on the house is different. And it moves to another color here, orange. And in the end, there is a blue color roof. So, it's very nicely planned. Both sides, it's flanked by beautiful aqua blue floral motifs and 
flanking both of that is a lovely row of deep navy blue peacock motifs. And again, towards the edge, you have one more round of floral aqua blue motifs and stripes in aqua blue and orange. So it's very, very pretty the way it looks. Let's see how they have planned the blouse for the sari. I'm sure it'll be quite minimal. Yes. Plain, nice, dark brownish red color, which contrasts beautifully with the body. This is how the whole thing will look together. Really, really pretty. And of course, this fabric is so soft and so light. Kosa Tasa silks are a pleasure to hold and to drape. Now let's take a look at this beautiful indigo blue Kosa Tasa silk sari. Wonderful, lovely color. It's got beautiful motifs all over the body. I'll just open out the sari, show you the full body. Yes, yeah, beautiful. It's a lovely shade of uh, indigo, the slight purple tint. So it's kind of an indigo blue with a purplish hue. It's got lovely wheel motifs all over the body. Beautiful wheels, uh, you know, almost like this, the temple chariot wheels. Uh, it's alternating in red and uh, beige, uh, the wheels, and it's very, very pretty across the body, this motif. And on the bottom, of course, you can see alternating wheel and elephant motifs are going throughout the body. And in the top, plain silver band. So this is how the body of the sari is. Let's take a look at the pallu of the sari. As you can see, the pallu has got a beautiful rendition of elephants, peacocks, and the, and the temple chariot wheel beautifully woven in red and beige intricately woven all over the pallu it's a large pallu and you also have nice little floral element on the edges and finishing it off is a beautiful you know kind of an alternating you know monkey motif here in the edge with red dots in the each corner so this is how the pallu looks it's a beautiful very artistic pallu I'll just show the blouse to you. Wow, nice. The blouse is beautiful. Silver white stripes is the blouse, which contrasts nicely with the body. So it's a lovely Chhattisgarh Kosa Tasa silk uh, sari. And one speciality of this sari is of the Kosa silk is that it's so light and the silk is very, very soft to the touch. I hope you enjoyed watching this video. If you want to take a closer look at the sari, and you want to take a look at the entire Kosa Silk collection, you can come out to the Avishya store on TTK Road, Alvar Pet. You can take a look at this and the entire collection of Kosa Tassa Silks. Thank you.